welcome back to another video so today i'm going to do a very quick very easy gel polish design i keep saying i'm going to do more of these um so yeah quick easy gel polish design so i've pulled out two colors just two colors from modern glam perfect white perfect yellow i'm just going to give these tips a quick base coat you can get 30 percent off Madam Glam using my code unpolished30 it's in my description box with a link to the website do you know as well a lot of Madam Glam bestsellers they're available in mini bottles now mini I think they're only $10 or something each as well so cute <laughs> right so look at that yellow so I'm going to do the two outer nails in yellow and the two middle nails are going to be white I'll do two coats again I'll just show you doing one and I'm going to cure each coat for 30 seconds the coverage on these gels is crazy. They're just so enjoyable to use. They really are. You don't have to faff about and keep going over them. And yeah, they're just a dream to use. I always say it, don't I? Right, so that's them. They've all had two coats. So I'm just going to start with the first nail. I've pulled out these little bee stickers. I got these off Sheen. Um, aren't they cute? <laughs> so I'm just going to use this little guy up here. I'm going to use two, actually. I'm just going to stick one at the top of the nail. Just use some tweezers. When you stick stickers on a nail as well, make sure you press them down and make sure all the edges are properly stuck down because when you come to top coat, you don't want any of your top coat going under that sticker because it will just pull it up so make sure your stickers are always stuck right down so I'm going to stick another one at the bottom exactly the same but his wings are on the opposite side on this one so once he's stuck down I've pulled out Madame Glam's black gel paint and I'm using Madame Glam's detail liner it's just a little skinny brush and I'm literally just going to use the very tip the very point of the brush and just do tiny little dots you know, like the little bee trails that, that you see on so many bumblebee nail designs. Yeah, just just the tip of the brush and I'm just going to do little dots kind of swirling up the nail and I'm going to join this bottom bee. I'm going to join him up with the top bee. <laughs> Don't know why that sounds funny to me. It just does. Uh, these, um, these gel paints as well, they cure in the lamp for 60 seconds. So I'm going to stick that in the lamp for 60 seconds once I'm done. <laughs> Right, so on to the next nail. I've pulled out Be Happy. This is from Sparkle Supplies. You can get 15% off at Sparkles with my code UPBA15. That's in the description box as well. So I wanted yellow hex and black hex. And I noticed this has got black dots. So I ended up using the yellow hex out of that. And the black hex out of this. This is Cruella. This is from Sparkle Supplies as well. I thought that, I always thought all this time Be Happy was black and yellow hex mix but it's not it's yellow hex black dots <laughs> so i'm giving this nail a base coat i'm not curing the base coat and i'm just going to do a bit of a honeycomb using the yellow and the black hex mostly the yellow and i'm just going to dot a couple of black ones so i'm just going to do a little bit down at the tip and i'm going to do a little bit in the top left hand corner yeah just just matching them hexes up kind of thing to make a honeycomb and that's going to get put in the lamp for 30 seconds as well.
So this is where we're at. We're on to this third nail now. So I want this nail to be matte. So I'm using Madame Glam's matte top coat. Velvet matte top coat, should I say. I want to put some little honey drips, kind of honey drips. I'm just going to do it in the perfect yellow. So that's been cured in the lamp for 30 seconds. Now, to do my dots, I use a dotting tool and I will just put dots where I want those drips to be. You can do them as fat, as thin, as long, as short. You can put them wherever you want them. And I'm going to use the longer brush from Madame Glam. And I just pull them dots up to the top of the nail. And this just helps keep my drips straight. I can see exactly where they need to go. And then I'm just going to fill in just a little bit at the top. Again, that's just a guide so I know where I'm going. And then just kind of round them off and make them look more like drips. Really easy way to do them. Um, yeah, so I'll let you watch that and I'll be back in a sec. So I quickly jumped back to that second nail. I'm just giving that a quick top coat just because them hex are a bit lumpy just so I could give it a quick buff. And now back to this drip nail. You don't have to do this. You can just wipe the tacky layer off but I wanted these drips to have a real glossy shine to them. So I'm just giving the top parts just a little bit of a glossy top coat and I'm going to stick that in the lamp for 30 seconds. Yeah, I just wanted mine to be a bit more glossy. So this is where we're at. So this last nail, I was just going to leave it yellow, but I found this yellow glitter. I don't know where it's from, guys. I couldn't tell you where it's from. I have no clue. But isn't it perfect? It's not metallic, I wouldn't say. It's not iridescent. Um, I don't know what I'd call it, but it's pretty. I really like it. So again, base coat. I'm not curing it. I'm just going to pour the glitter into this wet base coat. Yeah, I wish I knew where this was from. I'd like this in other colours because it's, it's kind of got a shine to it, but it hasn't. It's kind of matte, but it's not. <laughs> I really, really like it. But yeah, I don't know where I've got it from. So I'm going to stick that in the lamp now for 30 seconds as well. Isn't it pretty? I like it. So I'm going to get these finished now. So just these left two nails are going to have a glossy top coat and that'll be them finished. Very simple not too quick <laughs> them hexagons took a while but the rest of it yeah quick and easy there we go guys that's them finished i was contemplating sticking another little bee sticker on the honey drip nail mm, not sure what do you think should i <laughs> i really like them so simple um, but really effective i really like them anyway guys that is it for today um please remember to give the video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you're not already and hopefully i'll see you all back in my next one take care bye